as I have been mentioning uh, throughout the course that buying your pay into a trend is never going to work as a long term career plan. And when I say long term, it is like three to five years at least. Right. It can be more as well uh, based on the kind of investment you are doing, but it's the problem is going to show up. So uh, what you need to understand is that you are competing with a five years bracket. People with two years more experience than you and two years less experience than you. Because like we saw how post-graduation and undergraduation continuation, those kind of things can create certain different permutations. So you are always competing with a talent pool, which will be around within the five years, two years ahead of you, two years uh, behind you and your batch. So be very clear about what your goals are. Don't try to buy your way into a certain talent pool. That never works. It could be getting a certification, getting a post-graduation degree, moving to some other country uh, or applying to a particular company, anything. Don't chase trends. Have a clear focus on what you want. These things are variables. Visas, companies, employers, tech stacks. These things can be optimized to a certain extent if you have clarity in your mind as to what you want to achieve. If you start chasing one of them, uh, you are on a troublesome path. It works out for some. But for majority, it doesn't. And uh, online, you will only find content for those who, uh, for those whom it worked out. So you will always have a biased information available to you. So be careful.